I am Ra. I greet you in the love and the light of the Infinite Creator. We communicate now. Question 23.1 Questioner, you were speaking yesterday of the first contact made by the Confederation which occurred during our third major cycle. You stated that you appeared in the skies over Egypt at approximately the same time the date was given to Atlantis. Can you tell me why you went to Egypt and your orientation of attitude and thinking when you first went to Egypt? Answer, I am Ra. At the time of which you speak there were those who chose to worship the hawk-headed sun god which you know as vibrational sound complex, Horus. This vibrational sound complex has taken other vibrational sound complexes, the object of worship being the sun disk represented in some distortion. We were drawn to spend some time, as you would call it, scanning the peoples for a serious interest amounting to a seeking with which we might help without infringement. We found that at that time the social complex was quite self-contradictory in its so-called religious beliefs and, therefore, there was not an appropriate calling for our vibration. Thus, at that time, which you know of as approximately 18,000 of your years in the past, we departed without taking action. Question 23.2 Questioner, you stated yesterday that you appeared in the skies over Egypt at that time. Were the Egyptian entities able to see you in their skies? Answer, I am Ra. This is correct. Question 23.3 Questioner, what did they see, and how did this affect their attitudes? Answer, I am Ra. They saw what you would speak of as crystal-powered bell-shaped craft. This did not affect them due to their firm conviction that many wondrous things occurred as a normal part of the world, as you would call it, in which many, many deities had powerful control over supernatural events. Question 23.4 Questioner, did you have a reason for being visible to them rather than being invisible? Answer, I am Ra. This is correct. Question 23.5 Questioner, can you tell me your reason for being visible to them? Answer, I am Ra. We allowed visibility because it did not make any difference. Question 23.6 Questioner, then at this time you did not contact them. Can you answer the same question that I just asked with respect to your next attempt to contact the Egyptians? Answer, I am Ra. The next attempt was prolonged. It occurred over a period of time. The nexus, or center, of our efforts was a decision upon our parts that there was a sufficient calling to attempt to walk among your peoples as brothers. We laid this plan before the Council of Saturn, offering ourselves as service-oriented wanderers of the type which land directly upon the inner planes without incarnative processes. Thus we emerged, or materialized, in physical chemical complexes representing as closely as possible our natures, this effort being to appear as brothers and spend a limited amount of time as teachers of the law of one, for there was an ever stronger interest in the sun body, and this vibrates in concordance with our particular distortions. We discovered that for each word we could utter, there were thirty impressions we gave by our very being, which confused those entities we had come to serve. After a short period we removed ourselves from these entities and spent much time attempting to understand how best to serve those to whom we had offered ourselves in love light. The ones who were in contact with that geographical entity, which you know of as Atlantis, had conceived of the potentials for healing by use of the pyramid-shaped entities. In considering this and making adjustments for the difference as in the distortion complexes of the two geographical cultures, as you would call them, we went before the council again, offering this plan to the council as an aid to the healing and the longevity of those in the area you know of as Egypt. In this way we hope to facilitate the learning process as well as offer philosophy articulating the law of one. Again the council approved. Approximately 11,000 of your years ago we entered, by thought form, your, we correct this instrument. We sometimes have difficulty due to low vitality. Approximately 8,500 years ago, having considered these concepts carefully, we returned never having left in thought to the thought form areas of your vibrational planetary complex and considered for some of your years, as you measure time, how to appropriately build these structures. The first, the Great Pyramid, was formed approximately 6,000 of your years ago. 
Then, in sequence, after this performing by thought of the building or architecture of the Great Pyramid using the more, shall we say, local or earthly material rather than thought form material to build other pyramidal structures. This continued for approximately 1,500 of your years. Meanwhile, the information concerning initiation and healing by crystal was being given. The one known as, Aknaton, was able to perceive this information without significant distortion and for a time, moved, shall we say, heaven and earth in order to invoke the law of one and to order the priesthood of these structures in accordance with the distortions of initiation and true compassionate healing. This was not to be long-lasting. At this enter it is physical dissolution from your third density physical plane, as we have said before our teachings became quickly perverted, our structures once again went to the use of the so-called royal or those with distortions towards power. Question 23.7 Questioner, when you spoke of pyramid healing, I am assuming that the primary healing was for the mind. Is this correct? Answer, I am Ra. This is partially correct. The healing, if it is to be effectuated, must be a funneling without significant distortion of the in-streamings through the spiritual complex into the tree of mind. There are parts of this mind which block energies flowing to the body complex. In each case, in each entity, the blockage may well differ. However, it is necessary to activate the sense of the spiritual channel or shuttle. Then whether the blockage is from spiritual to mental or from mental to physical, or whether it may simply be a random and purely physical trauma, healing may then be carried out. Question 23.8 Questioner, when you started building the pyramid at Giza using thought, were you at that time in contact with incarnate Egyptians and did they observe this building? Answer, I am Ra. At that time we were not in close contact with incarnate entities upon your plane. We were responding to a general calling of sufficient energy in that particular location to merit action. We sent thoughts to all who were seeking our information. The appearance of the pyramid was a matter of tremendous surprise. However, it was carefully designed to coincide with the incarnation of one known as a great architect. This entity was later made into a deity, in part due to this occurrence. Question 23.9 Questioner, what name did they give this deity? Answer, I am Ra. This deity had the sound vibration complex. Imhotep. 